<laughs> Hi guys, I hope you're having a splendid day out there. So, can you tell the difference between real Norwegian and fake Norwegian? Well, that's what we're gonna find out here today. So what is fake Norwegian? Well, I'm sure there's a lot of different variants of fake Norwegian out there, but the type of fake Norwegian that I'm talking about is something that has spawned within this friendly banter between Sweden and Norway. And it's basically words that Swedes have made up that they think sounds Norwegian. For example, we have the word Gubelebe. <laughs> That's a pretty famous, the fake Norwegian word here in Sweden at least. This supposedly means banana. Or it literally translates into yellow bend. <laughs> in Norwegian, banana is banan, and that's exactly the same as in Swedish. You know, it's just a type of friendly banter in between the countries. If you're interested in learning more of these uh, made up uh, Norwegian words, I've actually done a video of what Swedes think about the Norwegians, and you will probably find a <laughs> a link to that video up here. So go and check that out after this one. And on the other side, we have the real Norwegian words where some Norwegian words actually sound fake to the Swedes because they actually sound like made up words to us Swedes at least. So I found a quiz online which tests your ability to see the difference between these uh, fake Norwegian words and the real ones. And I thought maybe you will want to try it out with me and see if you're any better than me. And be sure to post your results in the comment section below as well. It would be interesting to see. All right, are you guys ready? We're going to start off with the first uh, word here. And it's going to come up here. It's Spargeklut. Uh, I'm trying to pronounce it as Norwegian as, as possible. Norwegians will make fun of my Norwegian accent. But anyway, Spargeklut. Does it mean football or not? In Swedish, this would tr literally translate into like a kicking ball. Not really a ball. Klut is more of like a, an orb or a sphere. Uh, so in that sense, it sounds a little bit funny. Uh, personally, I think or I hope. My guess is going to be that the, the Norwegian word for football is pretty similar to the word that we have in Swedish, which is football. I think that they also say football, so I'm going to go with that this is false. Um, next word up is this word up here. Uh, let's see if I can <laughs> uh, pronounce it. Potetgul? Potetgul? good. Does this mean chips? In Swedish, it literally translates into potato gold. Potato gold. Which, it sounds like chips. It sounds like something I would definitely eat, at least. <laughs> Potent, good. This is actually a bit tricky because as I said in the beginning of the video, there are Norwegian words that to us Swedes sounds a bit funny, but there are actually real Norwegian words. Hmm. Just for that matter, I'm actually gonna say that this is true. This word actually means chips. And the next word in this survey is this one. Ingehand. <laughs> Ingehand. Uh, it supposedly means uh, hands-free. Uh, it literally translates into no hand. Which kind of makes sense. It just sounds funny to us Swedes. I don't know why you cannot be anything but happy when you hear Norwegian. So when you see a word like Ingehand, you're like, this this is too good to be true. I actually think that Norwegians are uh, so modern that they use the words hands-free. So this is a false. Okay, next word. <clears throat> yes, this one up here. <laughs> this apparently means uh, breast milk. <laughs> this word is pronounced <laughs> To <laughs> this and it literally translates into a tit squirt. Uh, so I might get uh, demonetized for that. But hey, what you gonna do? All right. So does tit squirt mean breast milk? <sighs> I, I, I'm gonna say yes, it does because you know Norwegians, right? The real word should be. Moosh milk. I don't know how to pronounce that. Moosh milk. Moosh milk. Moosh milk. It's closer to a mother's milk than to. <laughs> I don't know. I, I can't believe I thought that. All right. Next word on the list is this one, and I think it's supposed to be pronounced mo 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 or maybe mo I don't know. I don't know how it's supposed to be pronounced, but uh, apparently it means 
a painting code, like sort of thing that you have for children when they they're painting. It's a bit funny in Swedish. It's not hilariously funny. Uh, it literally translates into painting tuxedo sort of thing. For that reason, I I, I think it's I think it's great. We're gonna go for it. It's true, right? All right, so the next one is this one, as you can see here. <laughs> uh, Pums or uh, Pax. <laughs> Apparently that means crocodile. I have a, a big feeling that this is not true, but anyway, so that literally translates into a panzer dachshund. Dachshund is, you know, the short, uh, not so tall, dogs, and that is apparently a crocodile, that cannot be true. I'm gonna go false. Alright, next word, skuffevang. <laughs> that apparently means uh, wheelbarrow, um, but it literally translates into pushing wagon. Skuffevang? <laughs> that actually sounds a little bit funny, but is it true or not? Hmm, it could be. I'm gonna go for that it's true. Damn it, all right. Uh, so the real Norwegian word for a wheelbarrow is trillebor and not skuffevang. <laughs> you gotta learn some Norwegian, right? All right, next word. The weird part here is that I don't know if this word is real or not. So I have to like pronounce it with, with grace, like it was a real word. Otherwise I would just offend people in Norway, you know? I said, like, it's probably not even correct. Anyways, this apparently means um, eyelashes. But to me, as a Swede, uh, the direct translation would be eye whips. Which kind of makes sense in a way. It doesn't sound that funny. It sounds like something it could be. I'm actually going to go for that this is true. Alright. Ding! <laughs> Patrol. Oh my god. This apparently means a tadpole. This is a pretty famous word because a lot of Swedes know that this is actually a real Norwegian word. But this Norwegian would roughly translate into uh, ass troll, uh, which is why we poke fun at the Norwegian subtitles for their real words. <laughs> but this, this is, this is actually a real word. And the final word in this survey is Klumpesnus. <laughs> okay, I can't. This apparently means gangbang. Yes, apparently. It literally translates into uh, like gang filth, I would say, in Swedish, roughly. I don't know. If you have a better translation, then go ahead. <laughs> this sounds too good to be true. I'm gonna, I'm gonna go, I'm gonna go with false. All right, guys, I got eight out of 10 correct answers, which is pretty cool. Uh, how did you guys do out there? Please post down in the comments how you did in the survey, if you played along or not, it would be interesting to see. Uh, I thought this was a pretty fun a little challenge for me. If you have something similar, the light is flicking here, I don't know why, but if you have something similar for me uh, that you want me to do, then feel free to post that to me here in the comment section down below. And I hope you had a splendid time here together with me because I had a splendid time together with you guys. And until the next time, see you guys in your pretty faces. Have a splendid day. <laughs>